a Android phone. I have LG, but I using different uh, Samsung. But any Android phone is gonna work. You need a minimum eight gig memory stick. This is sixteen gig USB three. What is good? Then you need one of these cable to connect your phone and the memory stick all together. <coughs> then you need one screwdriver because you wanna disconnect your main hard drive and you just connect your SSD. Then your laptop.
Okay, step three. Do you have your USB stick? Do you have your laptop? You open up. I think I... First thing first. You need to go to BIOS. Are you pressing F? Okay. When you need a BIOS, you need to go to Advanced. <coughs> Data operation, and you change it for AHCI. Yes. You press the exit. You confirm the resources. Yes. Okay. And now you have your USB stick. You connect it to the PC. And you start the PC. When you start your PC, you're pressing F4, what is uh, the boot manager, and you choose the USB Windows DVD. <clears throat> After then, when you're booting your system there, you're just waiting for to get all the Windows notification. That's this one. Okay, let me get this closer. Okay. Once you're in Windows 10, I'll just go for everything basic. You go for install. For me, I have my. This is the new installation. I'll just show you what you need to do to do the Windows. You need to see your your hard drive. Anyway, I need to delete it. <coughs> okay, you go to accept. Next. You go to custom and then you have all of these the main thing you need to do first of all if you want to reboot your system then delete every shit from here system delete okay oh my gosh okay Everything deleted. Once, if you don't see anything here, 